We're very happy to have you. Yes, the car's a street car. Just got a canary on it. Just got it off hey, the inbound. Does it have air conditioning? I did, it did, but I put it uh, out. Oh, here we go. Race car. Right when, the, when the turbo went on, the air conditioning went off. It's not a street car, it doesn't have aircon. But it does have a defect on it, which I just got the car out of the impound. So, definitely a street car. It's a race car with a um, canary on it. So, Damon. Yes. You've just run a PB 968. Yes, 968, yeah. Tell us a bit about the car. You said it's a stock LS2 6 litre? Bottom end is completely standard. Yep. Uh, it's just a 6 litre LS2, completely standard bottom end. MPW's done everything on it. Yep. I think we first turboed the car in 2019. And Adam said back then I was on borrowed time, but I've sort of proved him wrong, which is a credit to his tuning. Um, but yeah, uh, it's it's definitely on its last legs, I think. You said it's got a T56, but it, it's- the... It's got the T56 Magnum from Malwood in yes, Queensland. Yes, So probably the, I guess you could say the best T56 you could buy. Yeah, and you've got to give yourself some credit. You've been pretty good on the- on the gearbox today. Ah, oh, nah, I just... I haven't heard any mischiefs. <laughs> I noticed you, you pull second pretty quick. I think, to be honest, this gearbox, you can't miss a gear. If you yeah. miss a gear in this gearbox, you got some serious issues, so. Yeah. What clutch is in it? Uh, it's a McLeod, 1200 horsepower, tailed up for a lot of street duties. Boost Garage is now offering Vic Roads Club Permit Registration for vehicles of 25 years and older. The great news is it's only a flat rate of $75, but if you're a member of Full Boost Garage, we're going to drop that to $50. For more information, jump on our website, fullboostgarage.com.au. So for the first time today, we hooked up a two-step, which yeah. I've got the, um, the two-step box there. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't retard timing or anything like that, so I'm just pressing that button and and just let go and hope for the okay. best. So, yep. Yep. Um, which is why a couple of times I didn't do the best run, but. I think I went two 980s and now a 960. I'm pretty happy with that. What 60 foot are you cutting in it? I, before I had the two step hooked up, I done a 152. Yeah. And all day today is either 154 or 158. So you've got the um, the VN BT1 suspension though, like the Thomas Town suspension. It's pretty low. It's probably not <laughs> ideal is, for drag racing, but it's working. This is actually jacked up with the boys. We, we jacked it up actually. So it sits a lot lower on the street. It's got big Simmons on it and that. It's actually jacked up. I don't like the look of it, but yeah. a few of my mates are telling me, leave it on interceptors. Its original look looks good. How much power is it making? On a hub dyno, I think it made 620. So yeah. it's, it's got a fair bit of power, but yeah. I mean, putting it down, a lot of people think it's easy in a manual, yeah. but I got people, I got mates that have got way less power and 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 done a you know a, a, a worse time or a better time than me previously today. But yeah, it's it's hard putting down that manual. No, nothing against autos, but you know it's nice to see something different. You don't see many of them anymore. People have sort of uh, stopped modifying them. No, I don't think I'll ever go auto. I mean, so many people say to me, "Go auto, you'll go an 890 or whatever." And to me, I've driven auto cars down the track, and it's it's boring. It's boring, and I'm, I'm not taking it away from anyone, but. Have you had to, like, have you had to change, you know, um, reinforce your rear arms or anything, like? Yeah, so I've actually got Vikings in it now. Yeah. I put Vikings in it. We come out on Chop Springs. Yeah. Um, there's actually a, probably a clip that you'll find of me and a bloke there saying we went 1050 with Chop Springs and we're pretty excited about that. But, yeah, we eventually put um, Viking shots, shocks and coilovers in it. So um, that helped a, a lot. It didn't help with the 60, but it just helped with the, the whole car going down the track. So is there anything else you're going to do to it or are you sort of pretty... Oh, my, my goal was 990. <laughs> my goal was 990 and I've yeah. got 960. I mean, I'd love to beat Denny, but you know, he's the king. He's, he's the So king. just for people who don't know, one of our more favorite uh, videos on full boost is a, I think it's called Rowing Gears in an SV89. Yeah, that's the one, yeah. Nitrous, similar to this car, but uh, nitrous assisted and it ran what, 967. Yeah, so. 967, I went 968. So. <laughs> 
Denny, I'm coming for you. I know you, you're a good bloke, but yeah, hopefully I'll beat you one day. You're not going to run it again today? Nah, not no, today, no, 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 no. no. I mean, we just took the headlight out, yeah. I don't know why. The boys just try everything, they, you know, they do everything, they change with, change with the two-step and stuff like that, but I'll just drive it, hope for the best, so we went 960, I'm happy with that. I'm, awesome, I'm right. man, hey, well done. It's got a decent sized exhaust housing on this. What, what turbo is it? Yeah, it's a Borg Warner. It's, a, it's actually an S475, but Adam at MPW put the 480 wheel in it, the yeah. billet wheel. And yeah, I mean, Adam's done everything on the car. His tune, I mean, it's standard bottom end. It's four years. I, I don't know how it still lasted. Adam always messages me and says, that thing's still running, like it's impossible. But you know, it's, it's good. So credit to him, credit to him, definitely. If you ever, needed to refresh it would you put another stocky in it or would you build it you think nah i'm gonna i've got this motor and i've got an ls2 uh, ls3 at home yeah. um i'm planning to buy like lq9 block or a dart 427 yeah. and maybe one down you know, you know down the track going eight but we'll see yeah. we'll see i don't know if the clutch or the gearbox will hold but that'd be cool to go 890 you know uh, a great way you can support full boost is to purchase some of our merch We've got many different styles on offer, so what are you waiting for? Grab one today at shop.fullboost.com.au